alive within the moment, moment And don't go wait until the morning, morning You never know when it is over, over All that I know is we'll get older, older So let us dance this side away Oh, let us dance The groove and the light that flickers We get lost in the crowd, it's getting thicker We get away, get away from the drinks and chatter Haven't said a word, but it doesn't matter Feel the air get thinner Standing in a blurry dream No one else can see us Live your life within the moment That's the side of way technically like a chateau we're staying at the chateau de saucy it's very nice what did i say that wrong saucy how do you pronounce it i don't know not that then how, what would you think it is i don't know like sassy or, or sassy chateau de sassy Sa saucy just sounds weird it's <laughs> guys i pronounce everything wrong in french i'm really i'm trying but <laughs> S-A-C-Y. Anyways, it's really, really beautiful. I don't know if I can open this when I'm sitting here. But basically, it's this beautiful chateau. And the trellises for the wine are like right down there. This like this is the view outside of our window from our room. It's really, really, really nice. So yeah, we got here, we're just relaxing before dinner. Earlier, we walked around the town of Riam, Reims, and, and it, was, it was nice. There was some like shopping, and we found this little, almost not like a farmer's market, but just like little stands where people had tables. And we bought some chocolate, and we tried some little samples of things, and there were like wine tastings if you wanted to do that, but we're gonna do so much wine tasting when we're here. Um, so we didn't do that. But we did just, you know, walk around, go into the stores. We bought some champagne. Apparently there's cham some champagne that's really hard to find in the US. It's like- No, it's not that it's that hard to find. It's just, there's not a lot. It, like you go into a wine store and there's one type. It's a uh, Brut Nature. Brut Nature. So it only, it has like no residual sugar. It has no residual sugar. <laughs> Thank you. Um, so we got a bottle of that, and then we went to the cathedral, which was also really nice. It's beautiful, you know, typical cathedral. It was actually built in the 1200s, which was way earlier than we thought, so super impressive, very detailed, and just beautiful. Um, but yeah, I don't know, I'm really happy. It's like a nice, cool fall breeze. It's nice to be here, you know, in the fall time. So right now I'm just going to get changed for dinner. Also, our hotel room is really nice. It's got this beautiful gold mirror. When we came in, everything is all our stuff here now, but when we came in, there was a bottle of champagne, which we drank. There's these desserts, which are like apparently Marie Antoinette's, one of her favorite desserts. And this is the window that I was just sitting out on. So these were open and it just, looks so nice. I can't wait for that tomorrow morning too. 
and <laughs> this is the bed Lyle's currently hiding under the bed yeah. but yeah and then the bathroom is also really nice I love when it cut when they come with these robes like these white robes I don't know they're just like comfy that's how it's spelled um, it has two sinks and the shower is like really big um, so that's super nice so yeah, I'm just gonna get ready for dinner now. I'm gonna pick out an outfit, change, touch up my makeup and my hair, and then we're eating at the rest uh, at the at the hotel at the chateau. They have a restaurant here. We're gonna have dinner. It's supposed to be pretty good. It looks really good. It sounds nice on the menu. So yeah. here at the chateau <laughs> it was very good we did like a five course meal and we did the like wine pairing we had champagne of course it was just delicious and I don't know it's just so beautiful down there and then this morning we just woke up and um, we went into the same area for breakfast but um, they actually had this like outdoor kind of area where it was like the ceiling and the walls were all windows and you could just look out and see the like trellises and everything and all the leaves are turning colors and we're just eating our croissants and just enjoying and it was really nice so yeah so now this morning i just got dressed so i wanted to show you my quick outfit although i'm going to change my, <laughs> my shoes so i'm wearing this skirt from it's either from maj or sandro but i got it when i came to paris last year this little top from and other stories and then I decided to do my new rouge red lipstick and yeah I think I'm gonna throw on my new pink jacket and then for shoes I'm going to wear these boots so yeah I'm really excited we're about to go to just to taste some champagne or you know whatever it is so that's the plan for today
school where they store all of the bottles and they turn them and um, the caves. It was super historic and really cool. And then they bring you into this room and you do like a tasting. And so we tasted two <laughs> glasses of champagne. Both really, really good. Um, so I think we're gonna grab a quick bite to eat and then we're gonna go to the next one. champagne because all of the a lot of the champ not all of them a lot of the champagne houses are here so we found out that in champagne there's two main areas there's Rion, which is where we're staying and then there's upper which is where we are now so yesterday we explored the town area of Rion, and then right now we're in upper so there's this one street that has has moet i'm sorry my camera battery died so now i'm on my phone but what I was saying was, yeah, so the Avenue of Champagne, there's Moet, there's, what else was there on here? Uh, Perrier Jouet. Perrier Jouet. Uh, a bunch that I haven't heard of. Yeah, I don't know. A ton of really good ones on this street. So definitely, I think, um, I don't know, I feel like it would be so easy to come here and just hit up all of the, the places. Today we went to Tatanger. Then we went to Pomery, and yeah, and we just kind of tried champagne. Um, there was the cellars, which were cool. It's like you go way down in the cellar, and then um, they're made out of like the walls are made out of chalk, and it's like the perfect temperature. Tell me about the 200 kilometers. What about the 200 kilometers? There's 200 kilometers of caves. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> um, yes, there's, so there's 200 kilometers of caves and um, 
yeah, it's just really impressive and just the history of it all. It's really cool. And back to the chateau. Monday morning, so sadly it's our last day of our champagne trip. I'm just soaking in the last of this beautiful morning view. We're about to go downstairs and get some breakfast, and then we're going to go on one more winery tour at Ruinart. So I'm really happy about that, and today I just figured I couldn't really be bothered <laughs> to do my hair, so I just and it's supposed to rain, so I just put it back up in a bun and I just put on a little white turtleneck and then I have this skirt from Zara that I really love. It's like a brown pleated leather with a round circle belt. I don't know, I think that it's really cute. And I'm just gonna wear that with the same boots that I wore yesterday because they're the best um, that I brought with me for the rain. And then my little faux suede moto jacket. So, yeah, that's that, but we're gonna go head down and get breakfast. guys we're at the train station now heading back to Paris we just visited Ruinart and it was amazing and then we dropped off the rental car and we're just waiting for the train but it's crazy to think that I just did felt like what feels like a whole day it's like two something now and it's only a 45 minute train ride back and then I start work on EST hours at 
3 p.m. aka 9 a.m. so it's gonna be my first week here comes the train sorry I got cut off but what I was saying was that basically it's funny that we've had like a full day what it feels like today and then like the work day is just going to start for me in like an hour um, because I am working today so it's gonna be my first week like full week of working since I've been here actually my first day my first week of working since I've been here so I'm gonna see if I'm gonna be able to keep up with <laughs> the late hours and everything else but um yeah so I guess with that I'm going to end the vlog here so I really appreciate you guys watching um of course don't forget to subscribe um for more videos and check out the fashion squirrel as well over on instagram and hopefully i will see you guys next time